Hello, hello. Welcome, guys. Good evening. How are you? Hello, Ricardo. Hello, hello. Gilberto. Hello, hello Patricia. Patricia. Hello. How are you today? Hello. Good evening, guys. Hello. Okay, ready to to. Are you ready? <laughs> are you ready for your English class? Yes. Yes. Right. yes, I am ready. Good. That's great. That's excellent. Let's get started. Uh, can anybody tell me what information you remember about the class from yesterday? What do you remember? The modal verbs, they use the can, call, in may for requests or suggestions. That is correct. We were using may, for example, may I go to the restroom? Uh, should, to give an advice, you should go to the doctor, for example. Does anybody have any questions referring to yesterday's class? No. No? No. All right. So yesterday we were practicing a conversation. Uh, the name of the conversation was, what do you suggest? So we're going to do a little review about this information. Okay. Hi, may I help you? Yes, please. Could I have something for a cough? I think I'm getting a cold. Well, I suggest a box of these cough drops. Thank you. And what do you suggest for dry skin? Try some of this new lotion. It's very good. Okay. And one more thing. My husband has no energy these days. Can you suggest anything? He should try some of these multivitamins. They're excellent. Great. May I have three large bottles, please? Hi, ready to begin? In the conversation we're about to listen to, we will introduce modal verbs for suggestions and requests. Please practice the conversation with a classmate or a friend, as it is important to repeat for better understanding. Listen and practice. Hi. May I help you? Yes, please. Could I have something for a cough? I think I'm getting a cold. Well, I suggest a box of these cough drops. Thank you. And what do you suggest for dry skin? Try some of this new lotion. It's very good. Okay. And one more thing. My husband has no energy these days. Can you suggest anything? He should try some of these multivitamins. They're excellent. Great. May I have three large bottles, please? All right. Let me have two volunteers, Drops. please. Let me have two volunteers, please. Dos voluntarios, por favor para que me practiquen el diálogo. All right, Ricardo me. and Gilberto. Ricardo and Gilberto. Me. Ricardo, you're mute. Ricardo, Ricardo, are you there? Uh, okay, no. okay, okay, uh, okay. I begin in there. Hi, may okay. I help you? Yes, please. Hold. I have something, something for a cold. I think I'm getting a cold. Well, I suggest a box of these uh, cough drops. Thank you. And what do you suggest for dry skin? 
try some this new lotion. It's very good. Okay. And one more thing. My husband has no energy these days. Can you suggest anything? He should try some of these uh, multivitamins. They're, they're excellent. Great. May I have three large bottles, please? All right. Uh, at this moment, do you have any questions referring to this vocabulary? No, teacher. No, about okay. pronunciation or meaning of the words? Alguna palabra que no reconozca que quiere que se le explique? No, only the pronunciation with the multivitamins is Multi, correct. Multivitamins. 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 That's vitamins. right. Multivitamins okay. is correct. Okay. Thank you, teacher. All right. Now we are going to move on to section 2.9 lesson objective. In this part, participants will be introduced to the use of modal verbs can, could, may, for suggest, for requests and suggestions. En esta clase se presentarán los verbos modales y sus usos de can, could, may, para pedir y sugerir. Are you ready? Are you ready? Yes, yes. I'm ready. All right, let's do it. Hello everyone. This time we will be introduced to the modal verbs can, could, may for suggestions and requests. Modal verbs can, could, may for requests, suggestions. Can I help you? May I help you? Can I have a box of cough drops? Could I have something for a cough? May I have a bottle of aspirin? What do you suggest for dry skin? What do you have for dry skin? Try some of this lotion. I suggest some ointment. You should get some skin cream. In this case, can, could, and may are being used in question form to suggest or give advice. This is how we use them. Model verb plus subject plus verb have plus complement plus question mark. Can I have eye drops? May I have an ointment? Could I have some aspirins? What I want you to do now is to write a sentence using each modal verb learned. Please write them in our discussion box. Okay, so in esta hora, in este ejercicio, lo que vamos a de hacer aquí es escribir por lo menos 10 oraciones utilizando los modal verbs. Rakoff. May I have a el can, may, can, could, may for request. Me va a dar por lo menos 10 ejemplos aquí abajo en la discussion forum. You have 10 minutes. I'm going to put you in pairs so that you can practice together. Ready? Let's go. I I am joining now, so I uh, have to know uh, if you in one point eleven. One point eleven. One point two. Two point no. 
Uh, two point. Uh -huh. okay. Two point ten. Two point ten. Ten. Yeah. Ten. Okay. Well. Okay. 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 We have to do a sentence. Okay. Ten sentence. I hear. Yes. I listen. I listen at ten sentence. Okay. I did three sentence. Okay. Three sentences. I I I I did three sentences too. Um, I can see that. <laughs> okay, and Patricia. Uh, Patricia is here. Yeah. No. Yeah. I can listen. See. Sí, yeah. She is. Um. um you're off. Oh, I'm sorry. Hi, Patricia. Yeah. Okay. Hi. And, and I have a three sentence too. Okay. We can share uh, uh, our, our sentences if you want. I can't find it. Mm. All right. Okay. Three point ten. Three point ten. I. Uh, okay. My first is say, can I have a box of cough candy? Um, okay. My. And um, answer is try with sorry Tony candy. <laughs> the other one okay. is could I have something for a toothache? It's better to go to a dentist. And the number three is may I have a bottle of vitamin B? 12 in the answer is i suggest an injection it's more helpful than the capsule so okay uh, i suggest we we can join the the sentence okay i'm sorry i can't find a uh, we are on 3.10 Yes. Okay. You have a three sentence. Uh, we have in two point ten or two three. Point. Two or three. Uh, two point two point ten. Two. Okay. Yeah. Two point ten. Okay. Okay. Now. Okay, uh, Maho, I write uh, your your sentence. Okay. Um, Only the sentence. Only the sentence, okay. Uh, with can, could, I may. All right, all right. ¿Ya terminaron todos o necesitan más tiempo? 
uh, we need more time because I, I wrote only seven sentences. Okay, okay. Les voy a dar otros cinco minutos. Let's go. Thank you. Can I have a piece of cake? Uh, number two, could I have another coffee? Number yes. three, may I have a rest? Number okay. four, may I, ha may I have a coffee cup? Number five, can I have vacations? Can I have vacation? Yeah. Okay, uh, we have three. Can I go to the bathroom? Maho, your Microsoft microphone is off. Okay, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Okay. Um I repeat uh can I go to the bathroom the first yeah. one? Yeah. Yeah. May I may I have a bottle of water? Okay, I feel Gilberto, do you finish? Yes. Yeah. Okay. All right, all right. Uh, is everybody finished? Or oh, you need more time? Yes, I, I finish. Okay, thank you, Ricardo. Uh, Juan Ismael, are you finished? Yes, for sure. All right, Cecilia? Yes, I finished, thank you. Uh, Maho, you finished? Yeah, we all finished. Right. All right, Gilberto, are you finished? Okay, Rebecca, are you finished? Rebecca, can you hear me? No. Are you finished, Rebecca? No, teacher. No. Oh, okay. Patricia, are you finished? I finished. Okay. Ah, pues Rebecca le va a quedar de tarea. Okay, let's continue, guys. We're going to look at the next section. The next section is coming from section number 2.11. Section number 2.11, Knowledge Check. Instructions, complete these conversations with the modal verbs can, could, may, have, try, suggest, or should. Instrucciones, complete las conversaciones con los verbos modales can, could, May, have, try, suggest, or should. All right. Los van a completar todos. Los voy a poner en pareja para que trabajen. Tienen 10 minutos. Pero estoy viendo que Rebeca y Gil. Ismael, no entraron, no es nada, no que todos entren. Ok. Ready, 
And let's go. Hola. Hola. Let's go. All right, veo que Gilberto no entró. All right. Rebecca, can you hear me? Um, yes. Okay, we start in um, the exercise 2.11. 2.11. Okay, we start the, the number one. We use the mobile verb that can, who, may, have, try, suggest, or show. Okay. Um, okay, for, for the first one, what do you recommend? For me, it's can. Can. Can I help you? Can I help you? Okay. Can, can. I help you? Okay. Can I help you? Traducción de can sería usted. A ver. No, podría. Podría usted. Podría ayudar. Okay, can. Podría. Number two. Dijo, te voy ahí, mi amor. Sí. Solo voy a hacer la clase. Um, number two, veamos. I have. Yes. Podría usted. Okay. For me, I think the letter B is uh -huh. yes. Should I have something for each, for each two eyes? I think. Uh, I B, yes. My. Oh, repeat. Okay. Yes, I should have. Shoe. I think shoe. Um, yes. And letter, letter eight. C A. The letter A. a. Sure, sure. I have a bottle of eye drop, I think. Um, okay. And number I creo que lo he escrito mal en la prim en la one en la number B. Or sure es la respuesta, ¿verdad? Uh, for me, I think, but um, I think um, maybe yes, I could have. Cool. I could have. Cool. Cool have. Okay. 
and show hi. Yes, who has? I have two. Oh, let's see. Let's see. Show. Okay. I could have something for each eyes. Okay. The letter A. Sure, I suggest a bottle of eye drops. Yeah. It's correct, no? The option is okay. Yeah, the option, yes. My, my, my option. Okay, it's fine, I think. We finished t-shirt. <laughs> all right, all right. Let's check it out. Okay. Um, all right let's check ladies and gentlemen uh, who can give me the answers for number one me teacher all right okay let me use uh, can i help you excellent can i help you is correct what about uh, who can give me the answer for number two me me all right ricardo <laughs> Okay. Yes, can, can I something for each eyes? Excellent. Yes, can I have something for each eyes? Is correct. The next one. Me. All right, Gilberto. Cecilia, your Cecilia, your microphone is off. Okay, thank you. All right, sure. thank you, Mao. A drops. Sure. Which one is it? Okay. Sure. I'm just suggest. I suggest a bottle yeah, of eye drops. Yeah. That's right. I suggest a bottle of eye drops. Okay. The next one, Patricia, letter B. Okay. What do you suggest for some muscles? What do you suggest for some muscles? Muscles. Or what do you have for some muscles? It's okay also. The next one. You should try this ointment. It's excellent. Very good. You should try this ointment. It's excellent is correct. The next one, three. Can I have a box of bandage, please? Very good. Can, can I have a box of bandages? Bandages. Repeat, please. Bandages. 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 All right, the next one. And what do you suggest for insomnia? All right. And what do you suggest for insomnia or what do you have for insomnia? Yes. The last one, A. Try some of Try. this herbal tea. It's very relaxing. Sorry, oh. Patricia. <laughs> oh, Try some of this herbal tea. It's very relaxing. Thank you. you. Sure? Yes. Can you pronounce the number two? Of course. Number two is what do you have or what do you suggest for some muscles? No, teacher, the number, okay, sorry. A, B. Letter B. One B, one B, sorry. Uh, one, one B. One B says, yes. Can I have something for itchy eyes? Itchy eyes. It, Itchy eye. 
itchy, itchy. eyes. Without T, itchy With, eyes. Without T, itchy eyes. Itchy eyes. What is the meaning okay. of itchy? Itchy is uh, que le pican. Okay. Ojos que le pican. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. Eyes. Let's continue for the next activity, guys. Number okay. 2.12, lesson objective. Let's check it out. In this session, participants will develop listening skills for specific information. En esta clase, los participantes desarrollarán habilidades para escuchar información específica. All right, we're going to do section 2.13. Listening, try this. Instructions, listen to four people talk to a pharmacist. Choose on each person's problem. Instrucciones, escuche a cuatro personas hablar con el farmacéutico. Escoge el problema de cada persona. All right, so what you're going to do is I'm going to play the audio. And you are going to identify if the man is talking about sore feet, itchy feet, the woman can't eat, she has an upset stomach, difficulty sleeping, sleeping too much, burned her hand, or had a bad sunburn. So you're going to look at these and see which one is the correct one. All right. I'm going to put you in pairs so that you can practice the audio in pairs on your platform. Are you ready? Cool. Let's go. You have 10 minutes. And Ismail. Your microphone is turning off. Okay, thank you. Okay. Okay, Maho and Vistara. Okay. Uh, where we are? You here. put the audio, the audio or me? I uh, put you. Can okay. you put this? Okay. Do you hear? Yeah. Do you hear? No, I'm going to put two, okay? Okay, okay. It's the number one, no? Yes. Okay. Okay, next. If you want, um, listen all the audio and put our, our answer and then we discuss. Okay. I'll give you some pills to take for a few days. They should help. Take two of these three times a day with meals. Three. Can I help you? Yes. I just came back from London on a long 
We have several things for that, including sleeping pills. But I suggest you try some of this herbal tea. It's very good for jet lag. Thanks. I don't like it. London on a long flight, and I'm having trouble sleeping. We have several things for that, including sleeping pills. But I suggest you very good for Drink some before you go to bed at night. Thanks. I'll try it. I don't like taking sleeping pills. Four. Good morning. What can I do for you? Um, I need something for a burn. I burned my hand a little when I was cooking last night. Look here. Oh, yes. I'll give you some cream for it. After you put on the cream, place a bandage over it for a few days. Thanks. Sorry? I finished. Yeah, well. Okay, number one is uh, the man's feet are sore. Yeah. The number, number two, two, what? The woman yes? has an upset stomach. Upset stomach, yes. The number three is the man has difficulty sleeping. Yes, all right. And the number four is the woman burning her hand. Yes. It's okay. Good. Okay, we can we, we can no. wait. Okay. We can wait for the teacher. Yeah. Where are you live, Majo? Uh, in La Cima. <laughs> La Cima. Yeah. Okay. And where you work? Banco of America. And you? In, it's a an, uh, small. Thank you. Um, no, where I work. Um, how can I tell you? It's a. Um, no, it's not the town. No, it's el trabajo. It's un la oficina. It's a small office. Uh, we have a, a new enter, enterprise. <laughs> <laughs> what do you do? Um, we, are, we are work with uh, centrales telefonicas, Marta Al Capel. Oh, interesting. <laughs> you, you? I am a brand manager of uh -huh. uh, David Cars. David Cars. Ah, okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Where do you work? Near of your home or? Ah, no. I I I go every day to the Gran Villa because the oh, bank yeah. is the office of the bank. Uh, uh, are there? Yeah. Ah, okay. Yeah. Uh, okay. All right, all right. Is everybody finished? Okay, yeah, let's sure. let's check it out. Number one, Cecilia. Number one. Mm -hmm. The men's feet are sore. Excellent. Number two, Gilberto. Number two, the woman has an upset stomach. Very good. Number three, Maho. Your mic is on mute, Maho. There you go. Okay. The man has difficulty sleeping. Excellent. And the last one, Juan Ismael. Okay. The woman burned her hand. Very good. The woman burned her hand is correct. Burned her hand. Okay. Now we're going to move on. 
and we are going to be practicing from the next section. I'm going to put you on mute because I hear a lot of interference. Sorry. Okay. All right. We're going to be looking at section number three. In this session, participants will listen to a conversation between two people deciding where to go for dinner. Words such as so, to, neither, and either will be introduced. In esta clase, los participantes escucharán una conversación entre dos personas decidiendo dónde ir a cenar. Palabras como entonces, también y tampoco serán presentadas. Any questions, ladies and gentlemen? Okay. Just one. Yes. What is your question, Cecilia? So, en tú mm -hmm. are entonces. Uh, so and? Tú. Tú es también. Okay. So, entonces. Tú también. That's right. When neither I say... And either it are... Neither tampoco. and either are tampoco. That's right. Okay. For example, if you say, I don't like horror movies. Yeah, you can say me neither or me either. Both are okay. Okay. Thank and you. then uh, so has different meanings. Uh, but right now we're going to learn one meaning. If, for example... I am learning English, so I want to be a supervisor. I am learning English, so I want more money. I am learning English, so I can get a better job opportunity. I am learning English, so I can communicate with American people. Okay, I understand. Thank you. Okay, are you ready for the video? Yes. Yes, teacher. Hi, welcome to another section. This time we will take words of agreements. Please copy the following words in your notes. So, to, neither, either. And in practice. Say. So. Would you like to go out to dinner tonight? Sure. Where do you want to go? Well, what do you think of Indian food? I love it, but I'm not really in the mood for it today. Yeah, I'm not either, I guess. It's a bit spicy. How do you like Japanese food? Oh, I like it a lot. I do too. And I know a nice Japanese restaurant near here. It's called Aroha. Oh, I've always wanted to go there. Terrific. Let's go. Notice how they use either and to in the dialogue? Excellent. Now what I want you to do is to practice the conversation with a friend. Okay, so now what we're going to do is we are going to go ahead and Practice the conversation in pairs. Uh, I'm not either, I guess. I want you to practice the conversation at least five times. Repeat after me. Say. 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 Would you like to go out to dinner tonight? Would you like to go out to dinner tonight? tonight? Sure. 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 Where do you want to go? Where do you want to go? Well, what do you think of Indian food? Well, what do you think of Indian food? I love it. I love it. I love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. But I'm not really in the mood for it today. But, but I'm not ready for it today. Yeah, I'm not either. Yeah, yeah I'm, I'm not, not either. either. 
I guess. I guess. I guess. It's a bit spicy. It's a bit spicy. Hmm. How do you like Japanese food? Mm, how do you like Japanese food? I like Japanese. Uh, I like it a lot. Oh, I like it. I like it a lot. I do too. I do. I do too. Too. And I know a nice Japanese restaurant near here. And I, I know a nice restaurant near here. Near here. It's called Iroa. It's called Iroa. Iroa. Oh, I've always wanted to go there. I've, I've always, always wanted, wanted to, go there. to go there. Terrific. 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 Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Go. You sure? All right. Yes, sir. Uh, you how translate how what is the meaning of when? What do you think? Okay. I love it, but I but I'm not really in the mood for it today. Ah, oh, okay. Can somebody answer the question? Can no está de ánimos? Exposición. De ánimo de humor. That's okay. right. That is Thank correct. You. That is correct. Another question from the vocabulary? No, that's okay for me. Nobody? Nobody. All right. So at this moment, I'm going to put everybody in pairs. And I would like for you guys to practice the conversation at least five times. Are you ready? Okay. Let's, okay. let's do it. Hi. Okay. Who stars? You? With with who? Yes, I am. With Patricia. <laughs> okay, hey, Patricia. Okay. Say, would you like to go out to dinner tonight? Bajo. Sure. <laughs> Where do you want to go? Well, what do you think? Of Indian food? I love it, but I am not really in the mood for it today. Yeah, I'm not either. I guess it's yeah, a bit yeah. spicy. Mm, how do you like Japanese food? Where are you? Huh? Oh, I like it a lot. I do too. And I know a nice Japanese restaurant restaurant near here. It's called Airoha. Oh, I've always wanted to go to go there. Terrific, let's go. Okay, Maho and Patricia. Okay, Patricia. Okay. Are you ready? I'm ready. Okay, Say. I start. I start. Okay. <laughs> Say. Okay. I'm Jess and you both. Okay. Oh. <laughs> okay. Okay. Say, would you like would you like to go go out to dinner tonight? Sure. Where do you want to go? Well, what do you think of Indian food? 
I love it, but I'm not really in the mood for it that today. Yeah, I'm not either. I guess, I guess it's a big spike. Mm, how do you like Japanese food? Oh, I like it a lot. I do too, and I know a nice Japanese restaurant near here called Aroha. Oh, I always want to go there. Terrific. Let's go. Okay. Hi, Patricia. Can we can we practice, Patricia? Okay. You just okay. and I am go, Bob. Okay. Bob. Say, would you like to go out to dinner tonight? Sure. Where do you want to go? Well, what do you think of Indian food? I love it, but I'm not really in the mood for it today. Yeah, I'm not either. I guess uh, it's a big spicy. Mm, spicy. What do you, how do you like Japanese food? Mm, I like it a lot. I do too. And I know a nice Japanese restaurant in here. It's called Airoa. Oh, I've always wanted to go to go there. Terrific. Let's go. Okay. Maho, can you? Okay. Okay. I, Jeff and the, Bob. This I, I am Jeff. Okay. Say, would you, would you like to go out to dinner tonight? Patricia, you and me. <laughs> no, you. You practice okay. above. Sure. Where do you want to go? Well, what do you think of Indian food? I love it, but I'm not really in the mood for, for it today. Yeah, I am not either. I guess it's a bit spicy. Mm, how do you like Japanese food? Oh, I like it a lot. I'm good too, and I know a nice Japanese restaurant near here. It's called Airoha. Oh, I always want to go there. Terrific. Let's go. Okay. Okay. Patricia and I. Patricia, it's your Maho. turn. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, I'm a Jeff of Bob. Jeff. Okay. Say, would you like to go out to dinner tonight? Maho. Sure, where do you want to go? Well, what do you think of Indian food? I love it, uh, but I'm not really in the mood for it today. Yeah, I'm not either, I guess. It's a bit spicy. Um, how do you like Japanese food? Oh, I like it a lot. I do too, and I know a nice Japanese restaurant near here. It's called Aroha. Uh, uh, I always went to go there. Terrific. Let's go. Okay, the last one. Okay. Um, Ambo, who, who is Jeff? You. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, say, would you like to go out to dinner tonight? It's a bit spicy. It's a bit spicy. Yes. yes. Mm, how do you like Japanese food? Hi, Gilberto. <laughs> Hi. Hi. <laughs> I think I changed of the group. I don't know how, <laughs> but I, I need here. Surprise! Surprise! Yeah, <laughs> I don't know how I am here, but hi, hi, Rebecca. <laughs> nice to meet you. Hi. Hi. I'm fine. <laughs>
Solo que no escucho bien, está cortado. Oh, really? Can you practice with me? I don't know. Yes. yes. <laughs> okay, I am Jeff, if you want. I don't know, okay. Rebecca or Gilberto. Say. I'm Bob. Would... Broken. Okay, if you want, uh, can we practice? You can be okay. Jeff and I be Bob. Okay. You start. Say, would you like to go out to dinner tonight? Sure. Where do you want to go? Hello? Yes. Hello, hello, hello. Hello. Your turn? Yes. Say, would you like to go out to dinner tonight? Sure. Where do you want to go? Well, what do you think of Indian food? I love it, but I'm not really in the mood for it today. Oh, yeah, I'm not either. I guess uh, it's a bit spicy. Mm, how do you like Japanese food? Oh, I like it a lot. I do too. And I know a nice Japanese restaurant near here. It's called Airoha. Oh, I always want to go there. Terrific. Let's go. Okay. okay. I think the time is over. Yes, I think this is the class is uh, the finishes. This is stopping in other, other groups. Yes. Uh, okay, we have to return to the main session. Okay, bye. Bye. All right, all right, ladies and gentlemen, time's up, time's up. Does anybody have any questions at this moment? I don't have questions. All right, guys, uh, we'll continue tomorrow. You have a good night, good practice today. Take care. And see you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Okay. Bye. 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 Have a good night. Bye.